Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for being here. I know I've told you a hundred times, but I really am blessed. I am so lucky. Uh, not only magicians, but magic houses send me product so that I can open the box and tell you exactly what you're gonna get. Uh, my show is kind of a mixture of a magic review plus an unboxing. I want you to know exactly what you're gonna get. Well, interesting story. Interesting story, uh, Hocus Pocus, I should give them some props here, hocus-pocus.com <laughs> sent me the Genesis system from Adam Wilbur and Volpine Productions. And I had it in my uh, to-do list for a really long time. And I hadn't gotten to it in a while, and I sent a letter to Hocus Pocus and said, hey, I'm sorry, I haven't gotten to the Genesis system yet. I promise I'll review it. And they said, uh, we already sold out. <laughs> we already sold out. So before I ever even got to do the review for them, the product sold out. That's how awesome it was. That's how, that's how awesome it was. And so interestingly, um, Adam Wilbur reached out to me and said, hey, you're gonna be at Magi Fest. And I was like, yeah, I'm gonna be at Magi Fest. He's like, cool, because I wanna to talk to you. I'm like, great. So I go to Magi Fest, and Adam's got Genesis System on his table. So even though Hocus Pocus sold out, Adam still has it at his website. So you know what I thought? I thought, you know what? I still have it, I should review it. And rather than give Hocus Pocus the business, give Adam Wilbur the business, right? Give him the original creator of the business. I know he only has a handful of these left. Hopefully, after this review, they'll be sold out because this is such a creative project. And through the course of me talking to him at Magi Fest, he did tell me that he's never gonna make this again. <laughs> he said it was a big, uh, big, huge project. And so uh, when they're gone, they are gone. What is the Genesis system? Why is it called Genesis? Well, Genesis is the first story in the Bible. It is the creation of the world, right? God makes something out of nothing. And so really to carry on that same theme, what Adam has done is he's made this system. It's really a kit, right? It's a, really a kit of that thermal paper that when you heat it, the ink disappears. And he's printed a bunch of different reveals on a bunch of different pieces of paper, all varying sizes. We'll talk about all of it. And basically, you'll be able to keep it in your pocket in a warmed state and bring it out, whatever the object is, whatever trick you're doing, and it'll look like blank paper to your audience. And as you go through the trick, the papers will start to reach room temperature and then the ink on them will reveal. And suddenly as you're turning things over, spectators now see printed items. It's pretty cool. So if you decide to go down to vulpinecreations.com, you'll receive one of only 400 Genesis systems ever made, and I believe they are $75. So let's say you pay $75 to vulpinecreations.com, what are you gonna get? Uh, you're gonna get a large cardboard envelope, and then inside that, 33 gimmicks. That's right, 33 gimmicks. This is a kit of self-revealing items. You're gonna get dollar bills, both USA and Euro. You're gonna get a treasure map. You're gonna get playing cards. You'll get business cards. Everything again, remember? printed with uh, thermochromatic ink. And you're gonna get uh, a little effect for a confabulation routine, and I'll go into all of it a little later. All right, so what's the setup and reset? Let's talk about that first, because you will need to get a paper cutter. That's what I'm thinking. I wouldn't do this with scissors. I would do this with an X-Acto knife and a straight edge, or I would do this with a paper cutter because you're gonna want nice, clean cuts, okay? You're gonna cut everything out, dollar bills, playing cards, all of it. Uh, you don't have to round the corners on the playing cards because the way Adam presents it is these are pieces of paper, right? And pieces of paper you would expect to have square edges. So uh, you're gonna have to cut everything out. Second thing you'll have to do is you'll have to go out and purchase those little camping hand warmers, little hand warmers you stick in your pockets or if you're gonna go out on a cold hike, you know, you stick those in your pockets. You'll need to get some of those. Adam's gonna give you a little vinyl wallet and you'll be able to put the hand warmers in the wallet and then be able to stick all your paper re revelations into the wallet so that when you bring the wallet out, you not only start your trick, but you'll also start with the papers blank. Is it what I thought? Well, yeah, I mean, I figured it'd be similar to other heat sensitive paper or heat sensitive ink tricks, kind of like friction pen, 
How are the angles? Uh, the ink will disappear at 88 degrees or hotter, really. And then obviously once it appears, everything's inspectable, there's nothing to find. What's the overall quality and production value of the video? Uh, your long tutorial is an hour and 35 minutes and then you have a blood on hand tutorial, which is eight minutes, and you have the cherry blossom tree effect, which is five minutes. Uh, you're gonna get an intro. Adam's gonna talk about what the project is. And of course, he'll talk about how the ink works. And then you're gonna cut everything out along with him. So he, doesn't, he won't say just like, oh, cut it all out. He cuts the things out in front of you so that you can see exactly where all his cuts go. He's gonna walk you through the tricks. Uh, there's a royal flush and you make that appear. He has the Tree of Hearts gag, he has the 14 of Spades gag, he has the Three and a Half of Clubs gag, those are all standard uh, gaffs and you probably know those tricks. He has a trick with a treasure map, he has a trick where blood appears on a hand, he has an effect where dollar bills appear, he has an effect where an empty tree blossoms into a cherry blossom, he has some mentalism routines where a thought of celebrity's face appears, he does a confabulation trick. And he's going to briefly cover every effect, not full blown fleshed out routines, but he's going to walk you through the basics and uh, he's going to have a little bit of a presentation idea for each effect. Is it well made? Everything feels like uh, cardstock. All the paper is the same thickness. So whether it's a dollar bill or a playing card or a treasure map, it's all the same paper. It's all the same ink. It's all that yellow thermochromatic paper. How much practice does it require? Uh, there's really no hard slights, really because the heat, you know, your wallet with the heat inside of it, that's doing all the work. And so that really allows you to build story. And really that's what you need to do. You need story for all of these tricks because the reveal is so creative and so fun. And your spectator might think like, oh, okay, well, you know, this is special paper. They might, I don't know. Uh, you, you, that, that only means there's more on you for patter, right? You need to craft beautiful stories and beautiful patterns to go along with this beautiful kit reveal system. Positives. All right, sort of the positives. I mean, it is very creative. You know, I've been saying that since the beginning. And I think the idea was so creative. Adam probably didn't even know what he was getting into when he came up with this. And so I think he made something that I think 400 people are going to have. And they're, they're the only ones that are ever going to have it. You know, they're going to have this special thing and no one, no one else will have it. And, and so uh, it, it, there's nothing else like it out there. There's nothing else like this out there where it's not just one trick or two tricks, but it's a whole system of tricks, right? It's a whole system of tricks and, and all reveals, right? All reveals instead of, instead of just pulling it out of your pocket and saying, oh, look, here's the revelation or pulling it out of your wallet and saying, oh, look, here's the revelation. The revelation comes out first and it's blank, <laughs> right? It's blank. And the reveal appears like magic. I mean, it really is. It really is. It feels like magic. Negatives. I think the only negatives to this is, you know, you can't control the, the way the ink appears. And if you have multiple items on the table, there's a possibility that some of those items are more uh, warmer than others. And so if you had all five playing cards out on the table, one might appear quickly and the others take time. And so it's just, it's like waiting for a Polaroid to develop, right? And so depending on how the uh, temperature of the room is, that'll depend how fast revelations happen. And maybe, you know, like I said, you can't control it. So maybe you want the cards to reveal a little slower or a little faster, that's out of your hands. So you really have to practice a lot with these and, and kind of get the feel for how it's going to go. I guess suppose the other negative would be uh, because of the cost uh, of these and the fact that they won't be made again and the fact that they're on paper, should anything happen to them, you probably won't be able to find replacements. But like I said, it's $75, $75. So it's under hundred bucks and you get 33 gimmicks plus over an hour of tutorial from Adam Wilbur. If you're a fan of Adam, you know how creative is it, he is. Uh, like I said, there's only 400, only 400 available and Adam only has a handful of these left at his website, vulpinecreations.com. That's where you wanna go. I wanna thank Adam, thank hocus-pocus.com for allowing me to have this too so that I could do the review for you. And I'll see you guys next time, bye.